Hey guys, John here with a review for you of the camera I unboxed last week, the Sony Cybershot DSC T200. For those of you who didn't see the unboxing, it's a very thin point and shoot camera. Um, if you look at the back, notice there are no buttons, everything's all touchscreen. I'll show you that in a minute. Um, to go over the specs for you here, it's got a 3.5 inch widescreen, a 5x uh, optical zoom. It's got face detection, uh, meaning when you take a picture um, in the back of the viewfinder, you actually tap where the person's face is and auto focus on that area for you. It also has something called smile shutter, which means uh, you can set it to when you tap on somebody's face, it'll detect when that face smiles and take the picture. It's kind of gimmicky, it's a little annoying. I turned it off, uh, found no use for it. So anyway, this is the camera, side shot. Uh, on the top of it, you've got the zoom rocker, the shutter button, the look at pictures and then there's a power button. The way to turn the camera on if you don't want to use the power button is just to slide it down. Turns the camera on and uh, there you go. See everything is uh, is all touch screen. Uh, the menus are very similar to the old Sony cameras with the dial. They're almost exactly the same just now it's used with the touch screen. So you know if you hit um, the auto button right there you know it pulls up a, a string of menus across the bottom. I don't know if you guys can see that. But it just pulls up the menus, uh, very simple, um, very easy to use. Found it took 10 minutes to learn everything the camera could do without really looking at the manual, just like a typical dude. Um, so, you know, overall, picture quality was excellent. Um, I was able to zoom in really far uh, on the pictures on my computer without seeing uh, pixels. Um, and the quality was really solid, too. Um, you know, I didn't want to, I can't really show you guys pictures, what pictures, what they look like here because YouTube would distort it. Um, so take my word for it. The pictures do look great. I'm a very amateur photographer. I don't know much about ISOs or any of that business. Um, but I guess you can change ISOs, ISO settings to be pretty high. So you might want to check the specs out, um, for that if you're interested. Uh, other than that though, it's really a great camera. It's extremely thin. Um, as I showed you, it'll fit in your pocket, uh, nice and easy. Let me give you guys a comparison here. Um, compare here at the iPhone, for example, you can see the uh, thickness uh, pretty close. Um, you know, not much difference. So anyway, this is the camera, Sony Cybershot DSC T200. Uh, I highly, highly recommend it. Um, you know, I think the best way to do this is you guys ask me questions and I'll answer them for you. Um, in regards to the video as well, like I said, it takes video at full uh, 1080. Um, the video was great. There were some questions about whether or not there was uh, audio with it, and there was certainly audio with it. It was synced up with the people's faces, um, so really no trouble there. Um, and it came out actually looking really solid. I haven't put it up on my uh, my TV yet, but when I do, I'll let you guys know. Uh, overall, highly recommend the camera. I give it a five stars out of five stars. Uh, if you need a small, slim point and shoot camera, that's uh, pretty easy on the eyes too. So anyway, guys, this is. Anyway guys, thanks for watching, thanks for subscribing, and I'll be getting to all your questions on this video and all the other ones uh, today in the next couple days. Um, so wherever you're at, have yourself a good afternoon, morning, uh, or evening. Alright, talk to you guys soon. Bye.